Welcome back to another video. No Sunday prep day this week because I'm going on vacation. So my current predicament is that I have to pack a week's worth of stuff into that tiny backpack because I'm flying easy jet. So that's the maximum bag allowance to, to fly for free, basically. So I'm not gonna pay for an extra suitcase. So now we get to see how all of this fits in that. Something a little like this. Um, first thing first, not everything needs to go in my backpack because I'm bringing some pants that I'm going to be wearing on Monday. Then a shirt that I'll be wearing. And I'm wearing a button-up shirt to go over it for some layers. And I'm bringing a light jacket. It should be uh, pretty warm, but I want to bring a light jacket just in case. Of course, I need some underwear, and I'll be wearing my trusty Converse. So, uh, that can uh, go on my person. That does not need to go in my backpack. The same as my passport, my phone, my wallet, that sort of stuff is just going in my uh, pocket as well. So, we'll put that aside and start working on the rest. So, my boxer shorts, I can just roll up like this to save space, and I'm just going to put these in this little packing cube and I can pack them nice and tight push them down as I go along okay that's one nice tight little package that can go to the side and then I'll do the exact same thing with my t-shirts so I'll just roll them up Nice and tight. And put them all in this bag. Let's put that in there. So that's six t-shirts, including uh, one long sleeve. And I'll just put my uh, button-up shirt on top. I'm wearing that for some layers if it does get colder. So, and if I go out for dinner or something, that looks nice as well. So that's already starting to look a lot more manageable. And next up, we'll pack some toiletries. Most of it is in a little uh, Ziploc bag, like my uh, deodorant, some uh, cologne, some um, um, shower gel, shampoo, conditioner, toothpaste, that kind of stuff. So let's put that into a little bag. And then I just have my toothbrush and some floss tweezers, just because you never know and a little lens wipe for my glasses. I don't need a whole toiletries bag because this is more than enough. Then we have my bag of electronics. So uh, all uh, the stuff I'm bringing is chargeable through USB. So I just have a USB charger with four ports, a European plug that I can use at the airport and whatever, and then a British plug to take with me um, in case there's a TV in the hotel room and I can hook my laptop up, I did bring an HDMI cable. And then I have a, a battery bank that also doubles as an extension for a tripod. Speaking of the tripod, that's right here. Wireless charging for my phone, some mounts for my camera. Uh, this is not the camera I'm bringing. This is just a stand-in because I'm filming currently on my Action 2. This is the original Action, but it's the same size. And my earbuds will actually go in my pocket. And... This is my mic for filming, so that will go separately because I'll keep that in my uh, pocket while I'm traveling so I can vlog a little bit. Uh, what else do we have? Just some USB-C cable to charge my laptop and some USB cables for ch uh, charging my phone, my camera, mics, all that stuff. A little dead mouse, a little extra memory card, just uh, things like that. So. That all zips into this one little bag. And then I have two pairs of shorts because it's going to be warm and I'm uh, wearing my uh, pants so I don't need to pack more pants. And then I just have some uh, pajama shorts for the hotel. Obviously my laptop, I almost forgot my uh, water bottle, 
and I have a little bag for laundry and such on the way back. So let's get everything in the bag. goes in there. And the water bottle can go on the side. And that's me sorted for my trip. So I'm glad it all fit. It was a tight fit, but we managed to make it work. So I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye.